Okay, so we are testing out Streamlabs OBS and capturing League of Legends. Um, actually, went online. There's a lot of people actually having the same issue. Um, I think it's because it, it um, transfers back and forth and it it goes back and forth between a window and a full screen game. So there's a couple solutions. Now my my preference is is to do a display capture. So what I'm doing here is I've got my Streamlabs OBS open and uh, I'm doing a, one of my scenes here real quick that's for desktop demonstrating and showing um, different tools and, and screen how to's and guides. But what I did do is I created two scenes down here. League lobby screen League game stream. This this is the only way I've seen to do it if you're not using a display capture, if you want to use either a window capture or a game capture. So um, I'm going to click over to my league lobby screen. So this is actually going to be a scene that is just designed for the lobby screen. That's this window here. Now, as you'll notice, you'll still see my whole desktop. And that is for this demonstration. I had to throw in this source right here you'll see display capture and that's visible that's so you can see what I'm doing here so what I do is I have my webcam scene um, I have an invisible webcam scene you can ignore this please uh, but a webcam scene here because I have some adjustments I have um, green screen and stuff behind me webcam scene the display capture only because I'm showing you and I'm demonstrating this to you and then I have a window capture let's go to the properties here real quick and in the window capture I am capturing the league client ux.exe league of legends okay that's what i'm capturing for the window capture so i'm going to do this real quick i'm going to show you a test i'm going to um uh basically hide my display capture watch what shows up you're, you're going to see this go full screen boom okay there we are that is how you see your league of legends lobby screen so i'm going to unmute my video or unhide my display capture so you can see the full screen again. Okay, do you see how I did that? Boom, there it is. That's full screen. I had that scaling full screen. Now, I have another scene down here called League Game Screen. Click on that. Not too different, uh, too much different. We have webcam scene, and that's visible. Again, ignore this plain webcam here. I have that video hidden. Um, again, I have display capture just so you can see this entire window, so you can see my Streamlabs OBS as well. But in this scene, what I would do is I would hide that video, that display capture, and make sure game capture. So I have game capture running here. So what that's going to do is when League of Legends goes full screen and, and gets out of the lobby, and you go into the game, the game screen is going to be, game capture is gonna, what's going to kick in. And I'll show you what that looks like. So here's what I'm going to do going to go into a training session here real quick. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's go to the play and I'm going to go to a training session. I'm going to go to a practice tool. So right now, right now what I would be on if I wanted to do this properly, I would be on and I'm going to do this for you. I'm going to go into my league lobby screen and I'm going to mute my video or hide my display capture. There we go. Now you see the full window. Now I'm actually dragging this around my screen, but guess what? You're only seeing, you see my mouse probably on there, but I'm actually moving this around the screen and all you see is the League of Legends window, the lobby screen. Let's go cl click the practice tool. Let's go ahead and hit confirm. I'm going to join. I'm going to add a bot. I don't care. Sure, Renekton, start game. Let's go with my favorite champ, Warwick. Boom. Okay, I don't care what I pick there. I'm just going to go in like this. Now, what's going to happen here, as soon as I load in, you're going to see this go... You're not going to see the game. And here's why. I'm on the scene that is the lobby scene. League of Legends lobby scene. Here's my lobby scene. Now, you still see my lobby scene, but I'm loading into the game. All right. It's going to load in here real quick. I'll try to edit this out. Okay, so now you probably do not see the game. However, I'm going to Alt-Tab out of this real quick. Go to my Streamlabs. Now guess what? Let me turn this back on so you see what I'm seeing. I'm going to create a hotkey 
Uh, I already have my hotkey set up, but what you can do is you can create a hotkey and you can hit a special key, like an, an, a control shift, you know, backspace or whatever you want to do. And what that'll do is that will move over to this scene. Boom. Now this is my league game screen and I'm going to hide my display capture. Okay, so you don't see my display capture, but guess what's going to come up? As soon as I do that, the League of Legends game is going to come up. Right here, boom. Okay, now you should be seeing League of Legends game. Okay, so I've created two scenes. One is a window capture, one is a game capture. Now, this is not my preferred way to do it, but if you're having issues with display capture, this is my uh, our fix for it. I much prefer, much, much, much prefer uh, display capture. I, I had everything on my desktop. I know some people don't like showing their desktop. I try to keep mine clean, and uh, I will show that real quick here. Let's Alt-Tab back to my back to my screen here. Let's go live game with webcam. This is my this is my preferred method. Okay, uh, do 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 desktop. Okay. Here we go. All right. So this is my desktop. Is it showing? Is it showing? It doesn't like showing. There we go. Okay. I had some out of order. Okay. This is my live desktop with webcam, and this is what I like to use because it actually just it captures the display. The display is first. So if I switch back into League, here's my lobby window. Okay. And I like this. There's nothing over here that I'm really worried about over here. Um, and then if I go into game, boom, it automatically loads back into game. So if this is my preferred method, I like the display capture when using League of Legends just because it switches back and forth between the window and the full screen game. Um, but if you do not have that luxury, again, go ahead and create two scenes, a lobby scene that is doing a window capture Okay, I'll let you see those settings again real quick. Properties. Again, we're capturing League of uh, League Client UX.exe. And uh, what other settings we have? We had automatic match title, otherwise find window of the same type. Okay, and then another scene, which is the game capture. And then all you do is you create a hotkey in your settings that switches back and forth between those two scenes. Um, uh, I, I do hotkeys for scene uh, changes and the only difficult part of it is remembering. You kind of forget, you get into a game and next thing you know your Twitch viewers are seeing some other scene and that's uh, that's frustrating that you forget to do that and I, I used to do that when I first started out too. So anyway, um, try the display capture first. If that's not working, here's a quick fix for you. Window capture one scene, game capture another scene. Hope that helps. All right, see you. Bye.